everyone, today I'll be checking out my new Westinghouse heated blanket. It's going to come with a great user manual as well as our easy to read control. It's clearly labeled power, heat, and time so we can adjust all of those settings to our preference and how cold it is outside. Now this blanket is very plush and super soft so I'm excited to try it out. The only thing you need to do before you use it is plug your power cord and that control remote into the blanket. We can set a timer on here to auto shut off at 2 hours, 4 hours, 8 hours, or 10 hours, and there are 6 heating levels. It also features a memory function, and we have great even heat distribution throughout this blanket as well as overheat protection for our safety and to avoid burning. It's very light, a super smooth material that's skin friendly, so you can use it if you have shorts, skirt on, or your pajamas. It is a throw size at 50 inches by 60 inches, so it's suitable for single use and curling up and relaxing at home. It's a compact size that's easy to move around and carry. You can machine wash it, just be sure to take the controller off before washing. Now it's important to note that this heated throw is intended for use only in the standard 120V AC 60HZ wall outlets. And you don't want to use your new heated throw blanket on a waterbed, bunk bed, pull out bed, fold up bed, mechanically adjustable bed, a child's bed or crib, a rocking chair, or recliner, chairs with casters or wheels, or basically any other furniture that's subject to movement. You also want to pay attention not to cover the controller or wrap the cord around the controller because it may damage the cord. Always turn off your heated throw when it's not being used. And store in a cool, dark, dry place. You can reference the instruction manual for more safety precautions.